Sound familiar? That is the way, not the original, but Tim Harden's version, which you could consider the original, of If I Were a Carpenter went. Kind of a cool little finger-picking song done in double-drop detuning. Uh, and there have been a lot of versions since. Johnny Cash did it, of course Robert Plant did it. I put a lesson together for it that um, we look at three different ways of playing it. One is just a very simple way of playing the chords with a standard finger-picking pattern. D, C, G, and D. But we do that in standard tuning so it doesn't sound like that. Now in the, do in the drop D tuning we take a look at the way Tim played it with some hammer-ons and some other slightly unusual chords and then also take a look at the way Robert Plant played, had it arranged, opening up with a little cross-picking pattern. And uh, then taking a look at even the way he played it live with a, a cool little, little riff. So if you'd like to take a look at this lesson, it's up at Totally Guitars as part of the Target program where there are hundreds and hundreds of lessons. So I really encourage you to check out the program for a small monthly fee. You have access to five or 500 songs at least. Um, but the, we also have a lot of lessons in the free section there to get you kind of started. And, and this, I, if I were a carpenter, what is a little bit vague in some of the things that we do. I expect you to already have a feel for finger picking and a feel for chords and a little bit of a experience in the double drop detuning to get the most out of it. So there's kind of, there's not really a beginning quality to this as much as a, a way to play if, if I were a carpenter very authentically. So I encourage you to come visit us at Totally Guitars.